Hey guys, welcome to Bluff Check. Today I'm going to do a tutorial on how to make maps in Photoshop. This tutorial is going to just focus on making the coastline, but I could potentially do more tutorials in the future if you think they'd be helpful. So I'm using Photoshop CC, but uh, Adobe has a free download of CS2 and I can put a link to that in the description and it will do just fine everything that I'm going to do here. So I'm going to start by uh, clicking here to make a new layer and then grabbing my paint bucket and just filling that layer with white. Um, then I am going to render clouds uh, and then render difference clouds. Now this is just generating noise. This is just what's going to give us our nice uh, real looking coastline. Uh, then you can hit control F and that'll generate clouds again. I usually do this four or five times. This one looks like it'll work. So then you want to go to image, adjustments, and threshold. What threshold does is it picks a gray and anything darker than that gray becomes black and anything lighter than that gray becomes white. Threshold, all right. So you can see right here, we have barely any white at all. And white is gonna be our land mass, black is gonna be our water. But if you drag it this way, it will start to fill in with landmass. And I'm gonna, I think a little bit less than that. I really want these two to connect. There we go. Oh, that's good, that connects up there too. But not down here, awesome. So this is just like a big bay, that's really cool. Um, so then you want to go in with your magic wand and select black. Make sure contiguous isn't checked. Uh, that way it'll also select uh, landlocked lakes. And then delete that. And then the blue that I had on my background uh, will shine through. Then I want to go in and I want to right click and hit blending options. You can also double click layer to do that. Uh, I want to add a color overlay. This basically just means no matter what color it actually is, uh, in the pixel information on the layer, I want it to be green and this green. And then I also want to add a one pixel black stroke and that just helps make it look clean. Now you can see you get some of this stuff here and there and particularly there where there's just some weird uh, stuff going on because of the auto generation and that'll happen with uh, auto generation. Uh, so you're gonna wanna use, instead of the brush, you're gonna use the pencil tool. Um, which it just doesn't alias so um and it doesn't matter what color you just want to paint in over those weird uh black dots if you want to i mean those could also just be small lakes uh so like i like this one that one let's get rid of that one let's get rid of this stuff at the top and there that's kind of neat the little island inside that lake um and yeah, that is how you generate coastline. You can also, if you don't want this island here, just grab the eraser and delete it out. So yeah, this is my tutorial on how to make your coast generated in Photoshop. Uh, I will could do more tutorials on rivers and topology, uh, but that's all for now. This has been Bluff Check, and thanks for watching.